Hey guys, today we're gonna discuss how you can use Domo AI and generate outstanding videos. Alright, once you get here to the Domo AI server, you have to head over to this generate video option. And here by simply writing this command slash video, we have this option to drag our own video and generate video based upon that. So first of all, we have this Titanic short video, which we're gonna generate. I'm simply gonna press enter and see. I just gave it a simple prompt. And here we have the option to select a style of the art. For that, we're gonna go with flat color anime style. And then you have this option to refer to my prompt more or the video. We will keep it to the video and the duration to three seconds. Then click on the start button. And here you can see our video is being processed. So let us just wait for a few minutes and come back here. And just like that, our video is finished and we can have a side by side comparison of our original with the anime version. And now if we have a look, you can see the video looks absolutely gorgeous and we can also download that. And now let's go ahead and try generating another video. So for that, I'm going to give a same prompt video and now I'm going to upload another video and give a prompt. And for this one, we can also choose the same style as well and click on the start button. And this will begin our animation, as you can see. And here's the famous bullet stopping footage of Matrix. Let's have a look. And it looks really good. I don't know about you guys, but I am in love with this AI. And here I was trying some new footages and then I thought, why not give Oppenheimer a shot? So here's the original footage on the right hand side. And now we have our animated version on the left. So if we have a look, you can see it looks good as well. And here I was trying some other footages and I thought I should give a different style a try. And this one is Oppenheimer. So let's have a look. I think it looks great as well. Now let's try their image model, which is initiated by slash gen. As you can see, it turns words into an artwork. And we have animate where you can turn an image into a video. So we're going to use the gen model now. So it is like any other AI, you just have to give it a prompt. For example, that's the prompt I gave it for the Titanic scene. Then let's see how it performs. And here it has generated the art for us based upon our prompt. We have gotten a nice looking boat and some characters. And here are the results for our prompt to image. And there you can see they all look quite nice. Now let's go ahead and try generating something else. With this tool, we can also turn our anime images into something more like a real image. For example, by using the real command here, we can drag in a image of a anime character. For example, I have this image. I'm just going to drag this here and I can also give it a nice prompt if I want, but I don't want to give it a prompt. So I'm going to press enter and then it will start creating this image. As you can see, it says waiting to start and let's wait it out. And here, as you can see, it has created a real version of our image. We can animate as well. And if we have an image, we can have an animation of that. For example, I have this image of Ronaldo. I'm just going to drag it here. And I can also select motion prompts and intensity. For now, I'm not going to choose any of those and press enter. And this will create an animation for us. And with that, our animation has finished. We can have a look at this. You can see this is sort of a cool animation with backgrounds in transition. And the character is waving his hand and moving his mouth. It's like he's speaking or saying something. Well, that was all for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching. Consider leaving a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.